More now on the backlash over that blackface tweet sent by Donald Trump supporter, uh, Pastor Mark Burns. I'm joined now by Roland Martin, who is the host and managing editor of News One Now and the uh, TV One cable network. Roland, always good to see you, sir. Thanks for Likewise. stopping by. Uh, you talked with Pastor Burns a short time ago on your radio show this morning. This is just a part of what he said. I truly apologize for the offensive blackface image of, of that cartoon and the um, uh, the depiction of, of, um, of the blackface is offensive uh, by itself. And um, as an African American man in America, um, I, I, I don't I don't stand by uh, anyone portraying themselves in a blackface. But the message uh, that I intended, um, I still stand behind. Uh, but my apology is because I think my message got lost. Uh, in in the, in the translation. So Pastor Burns st still apologizing for that image, apologized last night, apologized again to you this morning, uh, but said that he still believes that Clinton is, is taking the black community for granted. What else did he say to you, sir? Well, again, I mean, he texted me about nine o'clock last night and he said, hey, I want to go on your show, your show first to apologize. We've communicated a lot during this campaign. I mean, he realizes he screwed up uh, because he was he was uh, just vilified on social media. Uh, and so uh, reverse this. Imagine if a Democrat had Donald Trump in blackface. What will be the reaction from Pastor Burns or Pastor Scott or others uh, by, by doing that to Donald Trump? And so this this is sort of the, just the craziness in a campaign. Uh, individuals who are not actually involved in politics, uh, he screwed up. And I think what's important here, he keeps talking about, again, this whole idea of African Americans voting for Democrats. And I asked him this morning, I said, well, look, Pastor, Pastor Burns, Republicans have been horrible at communicating with the black folks and talking issues. And he agreed with that. I said, so black folks are some of the most sophisticated voters out here. And if you ignore African American voters, they are not going to vote for you. So you just can't just simply come waving the flag. Roland Martin. TV1's uh, Roland Martin. Roland, thanks as always, sir.